So you can visit uh, on, on Sunday. Sunday is our weekly visit. Weekly visit. Yeah. So we left early in the, we left almost about twelve. We reached there three. We spent an hour with him. And when we saw him on that day on the eve of Dipavali, he looked very sad. He looked so worried. And when we told him we are staying on the night here, he 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 was on the verge of breaking down. Uh, on, Sunday. On, on Sunday, yes, yes. Uh, we reached there about 11:30. We reached, and Manu's parents, father, mother, his uh, elder sister. Uh, Cousin, brother, <coughs> we were there, and the minute he saw us, he hugged all of us, <coughs> and he got his blessings from his parents. They were all in tears because the parents can't take it. Seeing him, a man who used to be so strong, they were not able to take it. When Manu was young, um, they were very poor. So uh, they looked forward for Dipavali because the father, the father was just a Tamil school teacher. He will go and borrow money from a Chinese man, and that's how they used to get new clothes. Even then, even though it was a struggle uh, during his younger times, but on Dipavali day. It used to be a joyful occasion. There used to be laughter, and they used to have lots of fun with with his siblings, with his family, with his parents, with his friends, and all the time, every year without fail, there'll be rumah terbuka. This year, at their parents' place in Banting, there wasn't a rumah terbuka. All his neighbors, most of his neighbors there in Banting, are all Malays. And they all look forward to come to his home to have a nice, um, good meal. And the parents decided not to celebrate Dipavali this year. So we didn't go to Kamunting to celebrate Dipavali with with him. We we took the opportunity because the government gave us a, a, a special visit on Monday. Um, on Dipavali day. That's why we, we, we grabbed the opportunity to visit him, to spend our time with him, not to celebrate. Talking. Talking. The children were just uh, cuddling him and sitting on his lap. And yeah. We were just with him, mingled. We just talked to him. He never had a little bit of smile on his face. He looked so worried. <coughs> he was expecting some good news, you know, for for Dipavali. He, he thought he'll be released. Yeah, that's why we spent the night there, think, hoping for a good news. We waited, you know, thinking that you know he'll be released and we can take him in bring him back home we can celebrate our Dipavali. Mm -hmm. Lawyers who have been there, uh, they will tell you that of all the five, Manu looks the, the, in terrible st state. No, Udaya looks fine. Not to say fine, la. I mean, we won't know internally what's, what is his problem, but he appears to be, to be steady. He knows he knows what he wants, yeah. Whereas, like, my Manu Haran is like, um, you know, he was a legal advisor. So his role was as was a, as a as a legal advisor. So he feels he should not be should not be there, lah. Um, we I didn't buy any clothes, but there's a good family a friend of Manu, and they took the children for shopping, and they bought some clothes for the children.
I didn't go to the shop to buy any clothes. It's usually he, Manu is the one who always takes us, yeah, eve of Deepavali. We all look forward because other days he's so busy with all his court cases. Is the business affected? Oh yes, terribly. Very badly affected. Very badly. We don't have any new cases. We're just managing with all those cases that he brought in. His firm has been running for the last eight years. Sorry, seven years. The eight years he's in there. The seven years, the cases that he has brought, we are managing. We are running. We are managing with those cases. We have got lots of work to do. But the funds are not coming because the fees have already been collected. And uh, most of the clients want him to handle. So the cases all are postponed. So once the cases are postponed, clients will not give us fees. No, that's why we, has, we just said, in Teresa's it was in every, every nook and corner, they, they had pressure. DAP, Ours is only DAP. Yes. The Indian yes. leaders are telling us, you know, they, I, sometimes I get SMS, you know, we, I'll make arrangement for you to meet so and so, so and so. Why? They should be the one doing, getting these people released. Why do we need to go and back them? The leaders should know what to do. The first thing, they should have got all the five out. They should put a firm stand. They shouldn't have open house. Correct or not? But they all are having a merry time yesterday. I saw the papers. Open house, open. How can they?